uh, Major Kristen Beowulf, uh, pilot and commander of the F-35A demonstration team. Uh, it's always cool to reflect on history, you know, people that were breaking barriers and, and doing things that, uh, you know, were dangerous or, you know, shouldn't shouldn't be done, uh, what people say. So, uh, obviously we're flying airplanes that are uh, fifth generation fighter aircraft are very different than what he was doing um, and a lot safer. So <laughs> I'd have a lot, uh, you know, less worries about flying this airplane uh, all around the world. But um, no, it's cool to be, you know, reflect on what he did if he's from St. Louis, uh, to be flying in the air show 100 years later, uh, to show off, you know, the F-35A. Um, it's, it's an honor, so I hope people actually enjoy it and kind of think about that as they watch the air show. Yeah, uh, my dad was a military aviator as well, fighter pilot in the Air Force. Um, so I grew up around airplanes, uh, traveled around the world with him, um, but kind of didn't think about it as my own career until I was in college. Joined ROTC in my sophomore year and then kind of fell into the Air Force path, applied to be a pilot, and the rest is history from there uh, 11 years later. I love the travel opportunities uh, that the Air Force affords me, uh, just to travel all around the world um, and especially to take the airplane around the world. So um, just being able to see places like you know Japan, Switzerland, Hawaii, uh, all that sort of stuff, um, but to be able to fly the airplane there, get out and know that um, you know that you were part of you know either a big movement or even just taking the airplane by yourself to places. Um, but also in this job particularly, getting to show the airplane off to the air show community uh, is a real honor. I would tell anybody, no matter what they look like, what their background is, male, female, any type of minority, uh, that airplanes don't care, just like a car doesn't care who's driving it. Uh, the airplanes react the exact same way, so uh, military is a very skill-based community, so as long as you can fly the airplane well, uh, nobody actually cares. Um, so whether you do it as a hobby or do it as a career, um, just to get people interested in aviation is our whole goal. Yeah, uh, when I was younger I never thought about being a pilot actually, uh, but obviously my dad was right there, a uh, military pilot since the day I was born, um, so I'd say he was probably my biggest influence um, you know even when I went off to college he was still in the military uh, flying airplanes so uh, I just grew up around it and it's kind of uh, you know following in his footsteps is, is really cool good he must be very proud of you he he loves talking about airplanes still flying so That's great.